Hello. I'm good. How are you? So Mike, can you take the steps out all kind of together for you and, and try and then, then take the steps to kind of get everybody else? It was a little bit further than last week. You know, I feel like it all kind of started when the video of George Floyd got out. You know, uh, I felt it in my heart, you know, I wanted to do something, you know, rather than just, you know, maybe tweeting out something online or, you know, posting something. You know, I feel like, you know, we can make a change in our own community. Black lives! Black lives! Black lives! Black lives! Black lives! Black lives! I can't breathe! Black lives! Simple, it's so simple. It's a beautiful day. The sun is shining, people loving on each other. I'm about to start one right now, actually. Say his name! George Floyd! Say his name! George Floyd! Say his name! George Floyd! Say her name! Breonna Taylor! Say her name! Breonna Taylor! Why? Why is it different this time? Because this time, America didn't look away. Last Saturday, I met Darian here, and he told me he had a vision. He had a vision along with his teammates, to bring our community together, to build unity, solidarity, so that we can all denounce police brutality, racism, and injustices that are happening across America. And I'm so thankful that you're letting me be here with you as we do that together. So today, your vision is reality. It's happening right now. I realized that once my career is over, I'll go from being, I'll go from being an athlete to being a regular black man in America. <laughs> I'll go from having my face on TV to matching the description. The America that I experience is different from the America that my brothers and sisters experience. And as a black man, I should not fear my life. My life matters. We're gonna raise our voices, and not only for myself, but for those who can no longer do so. I've learned that every truly good thing in life comes from being brave and stepping into the uncomfortable. I've lived through injustice my whole life. Not only me, but my father and my grandfather and many more before him. But I refuse to let it happen to my son. I believe with all my heart that God stopped the world in 2020 so we would have perfect vision and clearly see the social, and racial injustices and the changes that need to occur in our society. Black lives more than matter. Black lives significantly matter and equally matter. Black is beautiful. Black is proud. Black is wonderful. Black is not less than. Black is just as good. Black is wonderful.